Hi there, welcome to Apple World I need to continue on. I need to make I need to disturb individuals that are, you know, financial specialists that need to exploit me for a ton of brilliant showers and the gold squeeze. I will live perpetually, and I'll have anything I desire. The gold juice you never offer the gold squeeze. No, I'm a slime bucket comic. What's the gold juice? I don't realize I don't have the foggiest idea, however. I didn't drink it, and I didn't need it. And is this enough? I saw when every one of the young ladies, certain young ladies on Orange, um, changed. Definitely, it's a genuine article. It resembles a genuine article. I found the mystery of timeless life. I investigated God's eyes. Furthermore, you understand what I saw in the juice weasel after entertainer Taryn Manning, as of late, worked up a tempest with remarks about something many refer to as gold juice. Jim Carrey is likewise standing up for this reputed Hollywood custom where VIPs need to do a few upsetting things in return for cash and popularity. Jim is no more odd to condemn Hollywood, and he as a matter of fact reported last year that he's abandoning the business, and now that Taryn is straightforwardly standing in opposition to the supposed gold juice custom fans, they are conjecturing that this large number of TBs who get marked. Insane or leave Hollywood are the ones who will not drink the gold squeeze. However, what precisely is the gold squeeze? And is this the explanation Jim Carrey has chosen to stop Hollywood? We should get into it. That is the reason we're here. We're here to, uh, separate individuals from their self-images. You realize the orange, a major trend, is Dark Star. Taryn Manning, as of late, ignited a viral conversation after she showed up on Whitney Cummings' web recording and guaranteed she was proposed to drink something many refer to as gold juice in return for notoriety. Taryn Manning is now one of those celebrities that individuals like to excuse as insane in light of the fact that she recently had a few private matters and battled with substances. Anyway, Taryn presently guarantees her profession endured on the grounds that she would not drink the gold squeeze. So to give you some setting, Taryn was conversing with Whitney about how Hollywood is significantly more evil than individuals can envision, and she referenced Britney Lance's and the late Britney Murphy as instances of celebs whose spirits were destroyed by Hollywood in any event. Returning to like Britney Murphy like that was my buddy, and like what befell her and Britney Lance's like. I, I worked with her day step by step. I mean, she was magnificent. Darling, that's kind, and um, you realize just I believe she's, I mean, I don't have any idea what's the deal with her, however, it's like only miserable to see the destroying of individual spirits. Whitney then inquired as to whether she believes there's a degree of distinction that is simply excessively perilous, and Taryn said that it gets risky when you won't go all in or gold juice. Taryn guaranteed she was proposed to drink the gold shoes multiple times during her profession, and she said this should give her everlasting life and all the notoriety and cash on the planet. No doubt better believe it on the off chance that you don't go all in and don't drink the gold squeeze, so I was offered the gold squeeze multiple times in my 20s my 30s, and my 4s, and I peed a great deal of brilliant showers, and the gold squeeze that I will live perpetually, and I, I'll have anything I desire the gold juice. You never offer the gold squeeze. No, I'm a sleazeball comic. What's the gold juice? I don't realize I don't have the foggiest idea, however, I didn't drink it and I didn't need it, and I saw when every one of the young ladies, certain young ladies, on orange, um, changed. Definitely. It's a genuine article. It resembles a genuine article, like it's all a genuine article. Taryn said gold juice is frightening on the grounds that clearly, on the off chance that you don't drink it, they send somebody to obliterate you intellectually, and it's terrifying on the grounds that they send like individuals after you, and they can like sort of evening glow as like a companion. Or, you know, and their wolf in sheep's clothing, and when requested to make sense of on the off chance that gold juice is a genuine substance, or, on the other hand, in the event that it's simply a reprep. Sentation for something Taryn says she doesn't know. Furthermore, that it very well may be a similitude anyway. She again guaranteed it's most certainly a genuine article. You can have all that you need, all the notoriety on the planet, and all the cash I'm similar to. Consider the possibility that I just drank it. However, at that point, you understand what I mean. Like, consider the possibility that I and I don't have the foggiest idea what it will be. It's assuming it's a similitude for the gold juice. Like, you feel what I'm, I'm the thing I'm referring to. For the most part. 
Whitney then, at that point, poked a fun at adrenochrome, the paranoid idea that claims worldwide elites utilize a substance, hair gathered from kids as a remedy of youth anyway. Taryn said she doesn't have confidence in that, and she then proceeded to talk about how Hollywood is significantly creepier. Than any paranoid notion, obviously fans had their own speculations on what Taryn implied by gold juice, and a ton of them said it's fascinating how all the celebs who begin standing in opposition to Holt. Lai would get named insane foster substance issues or kick the bucket under baffling conditions one fan. Remarked, I really accept that at whatever point a big name declines it. They pursue them and through entertainers overseers get the to either become drug junkies or spellbind them till they lose. Their psyches to make sure they don't betray what occurs and Holly peculiar or begin having psychological episodes so they become mind-boggling with respect to the idea of gold squeeze most fans are saying. It's a similitude for some sort of penance you need to make in return for popularity, and Taryn isn't the main individual who discussed these penances. Kanye West recently guaranteed his mother Dee was sacrifice, and afterward, Dave Chappell broadly turned down a $50 million arrangement from Good Times TV later, making sense of that that he didn't turn down the cash. However, the circumstances that accompanied it, I wasn't leaving the cash, better believe it. I was leaving the conditions that were accompanying the newly discovered concerning Kaney as far as possible. Back in 2015, he conversed with Q magazine about his mother's demise and said, On the off chance that I had never moved to LA she'd be alive. I would rather not go far into it since it'll carry me to tears yet quick forward. Seven years after the fact, Kaney transparently said his mother was forfeited and he hinted that numerous other prominent celebs needed to make comparative forfeits. My mother ain't here, my mom was penance for me too. You see, no doubt, it's value. Michael Jordan, what might be said about him, his daddy, right? Bill is his child, right? Dr. Drew, his child, you out in Hollywood, a many individuals come up missing, feels like it very well may be a great deal of that to control damage eyes. They need to adapt and damage, and for this reason, fans are presently hypothesizing that the gold juice Taryn discussed is some sort of giving up of One's own priorities that celebs are expected to make to accomplish more significant levels of notoriety. And this carries us to Jim Carrey who reported last year he was leaving Hollywood after he went through. Uh, years attempting to caution individuals about the clouded side of the business you could recall how back in 2014, Jim made the Illuminati sign during his appearance on Jimmy Kimmel, and keeping in mind that the crowd thought he was simply playing Jim, offered something truly fascinating about how VIPs are utilized to occupy individuals from significant issues, moderators individuals on TV individuals in sitcoms have been recruited by the public authority to lose you the track to divert you to Matt. K, you chuckle and stuff like that make you cheerful and dockle so you don't have the foggiest idea what's truly happening. You know, and they get out there in the forest in a circle stripped and they conclude these things. However, what's much more insane is that precisely a year after Jim offered, these remarks his ex-ex-girlfriend Catriona White died because of a thought O.D. and Catriona's ex recorded a claim against Jim charging that he gave her physician recommended medications, and this is likewise. When the media began fishing stories to deride Jim and fundamentally faulted him for his sweetheart's passing, while the claim was subsequently excused and Jim had the option to demonstrate his innocence, he